Hey fam, I want you to like, share, and subscribe to our YouTube channel, youtube.com forward slash Roland S. Martin, and don't forget to turn on your notifications. All right, folks, Roland Martin here. Today is Monday, April 29, 2019. I'm broadcasting live from the International Civil Rights Museum here uh, in Greensboro, North Carolina, where we, of course, will be uh, uh, live streaming our event uh, in an hour uh, in partnership with American Heart Association. But first, we'll deal with our breaking news story. That is the death of John Singleton, the director of Boys in the Hood, Baby Boy, uh, of course, uh, Four Brothers, so many other different films. Uh, he passed away today. His family took him off life support uh, in Los Angeles. He checked himself into the hospital uh, a couple of weeks ago, complaining of problems with in his leg after returning from a trip. Uh, and then, of course, initially they said it was a mild stroke, but now we know that it was a severe stroke he suffered. And the decision was made by his family to remove him from life support. He passes away at the age of 51. The outpouring of love and affection for John Singleton has been enormous. Many of the folks who work with him on screen and off screen have been talking about his life life, his impact, and what he meant to the film profession. Remember, he was just uh, 24 years old when he was nominated for the at first African-American for Best Director for Boys in the Hood. In fact, uh, Spike Lee posted on Instagram that the moment uh, John Singleton came up to him and said, I'm going to be a filmmaker, he said he knew in his spirit uh, that he was actually going to do exactly what he was destined to do. Uh, he went on, of course, to direct, to direct a number of films. Uh, in addition, uh, executive produced foot movies. He also had had a show on uh, the FX network that he had been uh, working on the last two years. And so John Singleton, a major force uh, in the film industry. And so, uh, in fact, folks, uh, here's just some of the comments that we have been uh, looking at. Folks have been talking about uh, his films. And again, uh, those films include uh, Poetic Justice, Higher Learning, Rosewood, Shaft, as I said, Baby Boy, Too Fast, Too Furious, uh, Four Brothers, uh, Hustle and Flow, which, of course, led to Academy Award nominations uh, for uh, Terrence Howard as well as Taraji P. Henson. Uh, and uh, for just, just a tour de force, a tour de force. Uh, again, here are a sampling of some of those tweets. Uh, Peter Ramsey, John, you were a kind and supportive friend, a loving father, a passionate and committed artist. You truly li lived your life to the fullest. You didn't just make your dreams come true, but those of so many other people. So God speed with all love and gratitude. Um, Keisha Sharp, who stars in an, uh, a show on uh, Fox, uh, she said, I hold John Singleton in my thoughts and prayers. I pray for his family and friends for their recovery at this time as their loving father, brother, son uh, flies to a better place. I love working with this warm and talented man. We will meet again. Uh, and again, uh, folks, just uh, all kind of folks. This is what Taraji P. Henson, what she posted on Instagram. Uh, and this actually, this actually took place on Saturday. Visited you today. Me and Tyrese prayed so hard over you. You heard my voice and jumped up. Uh, I have hope and faith because I know that hashtag God is. Keep praying, everybody, for our beloved John Singleton. Again, that was what she posted on Saturday. Uh, Tyrese also made a lengthy post on his Instagram TV uh, account. You really should go look at that. And he talked about uh, that he was supposed to fly to London. And he said, but something in his spirit said that he needed to go see John Singleton that day because if he returned, from his trip, uh, John, he would, may, would not be able to see him. And so he said he turned to his wife and she says, baby, you need to go do it. And so he then went to the hospital uh, and where he met up with Taraji Henson. He says in his post, there were a number of other people who were in the hospital who were crying, who were laughing, telling stories about working with John Singleton. Uh, and he said, quote, uh, and he typed this uh, on his note section on his iPhone on this flight back to London and I, uh, and I just can't sleep. My heart is heavy. There's a feeling in my chest that just won't go away 27 years my brother our brother and family uh, in about an hour i'm about to tell you guys for the first time ever how the movie baby boy happened if anybody is down for a good detailed story stick around praying hard for you john you're not just love you're beloved and all of this hurts again if you go to tyrese's instagram account or his igtv uh, feed you'll actually see this lengthy post uh, set to music where you can actually hear what he had to uh, say describing the relationship, uh, how John Singleton came to his home and told him that he needed to be in Baby Boy, made him read the script cover to cover, sitting at his table. Uh, and so it is an amazing, amazing story. You want to support Roller March Unfiltered? Be sure to join our Bring the Funk fan club. Every dollar that you give to us supports our daily digital show. There's only one daily digital show out here that keeps it black and keep it real as Roller Martin Unfiltered. Support the Roller Martin 
Martin Unfiltered Daily Digital Show by going to RolandMartinUnfiltered.com. Our goal is to get 20,000 of our fans contributing 50 bucks each for the whole year. You can make this possible. RolandMartinUnfiltered.com.